So next we will talk about dating. Dating. <laughs> um, but I relationships and what I hope for in August for Leo season. So mentally for July, I, I don't know why my voice went out like that, but mentally um, I've been feeling great. I've been feeling confident. I've just been really humble and I've just been grinding. I've been on Herman mode a lot. So like I haven't been out. I haven't been really social. Um, I've just been really to myself, but it's not that I'm doing it on purpose or me acting funny or anything like that. I don't know why it's kind of like this. Hold on, y'all. But um, it's not me acting funny or anything. It's just me in general. Like, I'm really trying to, I'm trying to be very grounded. I am really, really, really trying to be grounded right now um, because I want to accomplish so much in my 28 years of life. I want to do so much. And I know in order for me to do that, I have to be very, very stern, very, very disciplined to accomplish everything that I'm trying to do right now. Everything else, like social, friends, family, relationships, all that, that's a big ass distraction and I don't need it right now. So I'm just really, I well, I have been really just focusing on myself. Like when I tell you, like my phone is dry, <laughs> baby, dry. When I tell you, when people ask me to come out and stuff, I'll be like, nah. Like, it's really different, but I love this for me because normally, yes, I would be out. Normally, I'd be like the social butterfly, but it feels good just to kind of like get to know yourself and just like love yourself and, you know, kind of like treat yourself and, you know, just explore the world because it's bigger than where I'm at, you know? So, that's uh where i'm at mentally right now but i've been really really chill like i haven't been like sad or anything like i've really 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 been in like a good ass mood like just chilling at the crib <laughs> something that i learned um in july is that uh god what did i learn um not to ew i don't know like i'm really trying to think y'all like Something I learned in July more than anything is just to let shit go. Like, I have let so much go, and I'm so proud of myself for that because I have held grudges 
on people for a very, 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 very long time. Um, I have been a people pleaser for a very, very, very long time. And I'm so happy now that I just don't care about nothing. Like, I'm in a new chapter. I'm in a new space. Like, my head is just in a different space. Like, I have forgiven people, things, and you know. So, I feel good. Next, we will talk about dating. Dating. <laughs> um, but I am not talking to anybody still, you all. I am not dating anybody. Um, there's nobody really catching my attention of that nature. Um, and I'm not complaining about that at all because I want to date myself for a while. Like I expressed that already. Um, I, I had a lot of healing to do. Um, I'm still in my healing girl summer. It's healing girl summer. But um, it's just, I'm not ready. I'm mentally not ready. I don't think I'm ready for a relationship right now because of so much that I have been through in the past that I just don't want to. I'm trying to work this correctly. I don't want to. I don't want to waste nobody's time, and I don't want nobody wasting mine. Okay, I'm just saying as simple as that. That's that's as simple as I can have it. I don't want to waste nobody's time, and I don't want them wasting mine. And in this society now, y'all don't know how to date. Y'all don't know how to be in a relationship. Y'all don't know how to be in an exclusive relationship. Y'all know how to do shit, but get it in at this point. And I don't like that. Like. I want the chivalry. I want, you know, the wine and dine. I want, you know, let's do holidays together. I want, let's take a trip, okay? Because your girl just got her passport. Don't play. Because when I get out this country, don't say nothing to me. But anyway, I want to do stuff like that. You know, I want someone who can connect to me on a mental level more than a physical level. Yes, physical is important, but where's your head at? What are your ambitions? What are your goals? You know, how are you spiritually? How is your mental? You know what I'm saying? So I just feel like dating right now is just not in the fits for me right now on the path that I'm going. And that's okay. Um, I have no problem with that. I know I'm an attractive girl with or without my new rag on, with or without makeup on, or because your girl got it going on, period. But, um, I'm very confident, you know, I'm very confident that I will have someone eventually when the time is right. Um, now, do I still be shooting my shots? Of course. There's so many fine people out here not to, but, um, you know, I do let people know, like, I'm not looking for anything right now. I'm just cooling and I'm chilling. I'm having fun because I've never really took the time out just to date myself and be alone and I've always like like I told y'all previously I always be talking to somebody or dating somebody and you know shit just you know it happens and that's life it's just a lesson nothing nothing major no shade um but yeah that's just where I'm at with dating I mean she yeah I'm single by choice the fuck <laughs> but nah y'all like seriously I just I'm just not I'm not ready to date I'm not. I'm really not. Like, I've curved so many people because I just get so annoyed so fast now. So, it's just like, I feel like the first week or the first two days of us texting, I'm like, man, you on bullshit. So, it don't even matter. But, whatever. But, no, I'm not dating yet, y'all. Period. I had to hurry up and make this healing journey uh, for July because I will be going to, not telling y'all yet, I will be going out of town Friday. Uh, for my birthday part two. Yes, I'm going out of town again for my birthday. I'm celebrating for a birthday weekend. Mine still, even though it's Leo season, it's still July. So with that being said, it's still my birthday month. And I'm still out the fuck side. Yeah, I am. Okay. Um, but what I hope for August though, y'all, is just still guidance. I want God to lead my steps. I want the universe to lead my steps. They've been doing a great job at that as always. I never let them go unnoticed. Um, I want them to continue. I want myself, I can't talk. I would like for myself to continue to uh, just stay grounded, y'all. Like, I've 
really, 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 really been healing. Like, I've been journaling every day, of course. Like, I've been sending hobby, watching my sermons, you know, things like that, of that nature. I've really been trying to change myself, and I, I'm happy with the new me. I really am. Um, and as much as I would want closure for certain situations and certain things, um, if it doesn't happen, it's okay. Like, I've already closed all the chapters when I turned 28. So, um, you know, it ain't no hard feelings to nobody ever. I mean, I've, I don't even have no beef with nobody no way. But uh, just to make that very clear, um, I have no animosity or anything towards anybody. Um, you know, I, I just don't. Like, my heart is just so big right now because I, I'm just so... I'm just so proud of myself and I'm proud of what I have become. I'm proud of what I have accomplished. I'm proud of therapy. Thank the Lord for therapy um, because she has helped me so much to realize who I am, what I am, and what I am becoming to be. Um, so in August, I just hope that I continue this wave of staying humble, staying guided, um, staying focused, um, and just being positive and to express to you all who watch my healing journeys that it is okay to show some transparency sometimes um it's okay to be yourself it's okay to even be on do y'all see how i look on this video some people are very insecure to be looking like this i'm not ashamed of it okay my nails not done i have no makeup on my hair is in my do-rag okay i i don't look you know my upgraded self i'll say because you know i don't want to say i look a mess because i don't speak that on to me because i know i'm an attractive person um but it's just the raw and uncut and i just want y'all to see that like it's okay to feel how you feel it's okay to be alone sometimes it's okay to not want to engage you know with your friends for a while because you're getting yourself back on track mentally and physically it's okay to you know not go out sometimes and just work on yourself and be at home sometimes it was hard because i love going out baby and i ain't been out here in like my hometown in a long time like i have not been out um and i have my reasons for that uh but I just choose not to, you know, just to kind of protect my peace and protect me as a whole. Um, but I'm really just wishing for just happiness for real, y'all, guidance. I'm going to be really on grind mode after my trip because uh, my baby is starting school. You know, school starting up again, y'all. So baby starting school. Um, so it's time to get it's time to get on grind mode. It's time to get on grind mode. So. I'm really, 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 really finna get on grind mode and be like on my P's and Q's. I'm definitely finna be pushing more content out. That is something that I want to do for my 28 resolution is push more content out. I have some videos. I have some ideas ready for y'all. I just got to make the content. So once when I make the content, of course, it's going to be bomb.com. Um, but that's it, y'all, for real. Like, I really have nothing to express in July. Like, it was you know i i cried when i turned 28 because i have i have managed to conquer a lot um and i'm very blessed i'm very thankful for all of my lessons and my journeys that i have had in my 27 years of life and so that's why i'm hoping for my year of 28 that it's just me making a comeback really like it's just me making a comeback of a better new version of myself I always love myself in every year and every stage because I learned so much about myself. And with 28 in my growth, it's just amazing because I just move so differently now. Like, people who knew me in the past, if they saw me now, they're probably like, Morgan put on the front. Or Morgan, no, nah, nah, I'm not. Like, I'm really just in a different headspace. Like, I'm really just, I'm, I'm a different person now. And I love this for me. I really do because I deserve it. I deserve this genuine happiness within myself. I deserve this humbleness within myself. I deserve this new chapter of myself. And that is what I'm giving myself. So, that is all, y'all. But I love y'all. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe. If y'all don't comment, just make sure y'all like or share it. Or tell a friend to tell a friend to look at this if they need to hear some guidance. You know what I'm saying? Um... But if you are going through anything in life or anything like that, just know that it will be over. The storm will be over soon. Journal, pray, manifest, listen to some sermons, stay positive, say your, pos your positive affirmations, 
and you will be okay. I promise you, y'all gonna be all right. But I love all y'all. Thank you for watching, and I will see y'all in the next video on my birthday trip part two. 